and if I press the button, uh, it opens and closes. So when I want it to be quiet, I can just press the button and then it's quiet. this thing all hooked up now and I will now show you guys how this thing works so it has two valves and if I press the button it and if I press the button uh, it opens and closes uh, and one thing that's pretty nice about this one is that it can open partly on both sides so if I just do a short press it opens both ones so you can have like an in-between and it also has the option of installing two of these so say for example you have a dual exhaust you can install two of these and they go uh, in the same box so that's really nice so this is the old exhaust the thing we need is right here which is the catalytic converter i want to put this thing in between the one side of the valve so it can reduce the sound and it can reduce the uh, smell because right now the exhaust has a really bad smell because it just doesn't get filtered i hope this will help uh, both of those problems so we're gonna cut this now and i'm gonna see if everything fits idea is that you've got this valve, exhaust valve, then on the extended part that I welded on I'm gonna put the catalytic converter. It's gonna start about right here and then it's gonna split into two pipes. One pipe uh, goes to the catalytic converter and then goes back into the exhaust but right there and then the other pipe just replaces a piece of this pipe. I still have to figure out where I can put that because Everything has to line up, of course. And one thing I also want to change is these uh, mounting points. I made them myself, but they don't really sit straight, as you can see. And also the metal rod right here touches uh, the metal of the car, so it's noisy and it rattles a lot. Um, and also we're gonna fix this ugly ass uh, welds that I got right here. Well, it seems like it was a good idea to probably change these mounting points as well because this thing just broke off I will show you what I have in mind so the old exhaust is pretty much the same this part but it has this nice mounting point and not this fabricated one by me so I want to replace this ugly as shit weld with this reducer and then the next is the exhaust valve so uh, I want to replace this part with uh, the exhaust valve system. Uh, this part is like almost exactly the piece we need for the valve system. Uh, and then after that, I got the reducer on this side. So we're gonna mount up the uh, catalytic converter to here. And then the pipe is gonna come into the three inch exhaust right here. I ran up a check, I might do it again. Enemies close, have me thinking they're friends. Ten toes down, I'll be free until the end. Crib outside the city, I don't feel safe in my ass. Took so many years, I've been swaying for the wins. I'm in debt to no one but the one who took my sins. I do it for real, there's no reason to pretend. If I do it once, I do it again. Add it up, add it up. Bankroll, bankroll. Euro, euro. Peso, peso. Add it up, add it up. I'm just doing me, everything is on me. Oh, you matter what? Add it up, add it up. So the exhaust is now all tacked up. Next step is to fit it on under the car, see if everything fits okay. So the exhaust is in, 
and uh, everything seems to fit quite well. So we're now gonna weld the rest of it. So I'm test fitting the exhaust right now, but I ran into a little bit of a problem because the because the Cadillac converter is touching the bottom of the car. So that's not good. I've already thought of a solution though because I've got some more space over here. So what I'm gonna do is make an S-turn in this uh, pipe and then I'm gonna connect the Cadillac converter, but at a little bit more of an angle so it fits next to it because it's also hanging pretty low. So. That will fix those problems, I hope. But yeah, that's the plan. So we're gonna cut the pipe right here so that we can angle a pipe upwards uh, and we can get the get a little further a little bit more space. So the catalytic converter is now on, um, as you can see it has a little bit of space right here so it doesn't touch. So now it's just a case of test fitting it under the car again um, to see if it now does fit. And if it fits we're gonna finish the exhaust by routing it back into the original exhaust. So let's do it. So the exhaust is now in, so the catalytic converter doesn't have a lot of room, but it's not touching, so that's good. Yeah, it's almost touching. Just to be sure, I'm gonna just tilt it a little bit more so it really doesn't touch. Um, and then I think we're safe. So I've turned the catalytic converter a little bit, and then in between here, there's a little bit of a gap. So I think this is enough. Let's do the last part now. So I think we'll do something like this. So that's it, it's 
it's all together now, except for the mounting point in the front. So the exhaust is temporarily in place uh, so that I can weld on the mounting point. So while I'm painting over there, um, I'm going to try and find a place where I can put this wire through to get to the inside of the car. So I found a plug right here that leads into the car. So I'm going to remove this plug, uh, make a hole in it and shove the wire through. So it's a bit of a mess here, but I found where the hole is. So here it is. So we're gonna make a hole through this and then shove the wire through here. So I've got the wire through now. On the side that's gonna be under the car, I'm gonna put this protective sleeve so the heat isn't gonna melt this wire. I don't think it will, but just to be safe. So now we're gonna try and feed it through the hole again. So first make sure it does work. And it still does, so that's good. So the wire is pushed all the way through. So I can connect it to the exhaust. And the exhaust is all painted now. So I'm gonna put it under the car, uh, connect everything, and then it's done. So the exhaust is all in now, and now I need to wire up these two wires. So this is where the wire for the exhaust valve. So this is where the wire of the exhaust valve comes out. So these two need to be connected, and then everything is done. So that was a lot of work, but she's in now. All the way. So that's really nice. And now we're gonna drop it and. Let's see if she sounds any different. 